We go to the watch on school of Montclair and top seeded West Essex takes an early 1-0 lead off the corner penalty. It's Gabrielle Girardi with the goal for the Knights. But number two Madison comes right back on their own corner. It's Caitlin De Silva getting it to Stephanie Delavia who sticks it in the cage and we are tied at one with 18.50 left in the first half. West Essex gets another corner and again it's Gabrielle Girardi with the rocket that hits the back of the cage and the Knights have a 2-1 lead with six and a half minutes to go in the first half. Then watch this great play by Madison defender Amanda De Silva as the ball beats the keeper but De Silva's there to sweep it away and it stays 2-1 West Essex at the half. Great play there. Okay, second half action and watch the great execution on the corner by Madison as Stephanie Delavere rips it to the far corner, into the cage, and we are tied at two, three minutes into the second half. Now watch the Dodgers on the break, and it's Delavere feeding Caitlin De Silva, and she scores, and the Dodgers have a 3-2 lead with 18 and a half minutes to go in the second half. What a goal. All right, West Essex is putting all sorts of pressure on, but watch the great saves here by keeper Emily Flamme of Madison as she makes a beautiful stick save to end the sequence and keeps it 3-2 Dodgers. Wow! And then watch Flame on the penalty stroke come up with a huge save for the Dodgers, and it remains 3-2. She was on fire, folks. Okay, the Dodgers make it 4-2 here. Watch freshman Elizabeth Romano chase down the ball and slip it into the back of the cage, and Madison has a two-goal lead midway through the half. But Sessis comes right back here. Watch Alyssa Menendez off the scramble in front of the cage, finally put it in, and we have a one-goal game, 4-3 Madison. And the Knights tied up here on the corner. Watch Leah Sinisi on the post, redirected in. And this instant classic goes to overtime, tied at four. Incredible. All right, no one scored in the first OT. We go to double overtime. And on the corner, it's Elizabeth Romano of Madison with the game winner as Madison stuns West Essex 5-4 in double overtime to win the North 1 Group 2 title and advance to the Group 2 semifinals. I've always seen this program since I was a little kid and it's so so amazing to finally be a part of it and it's just so surreal to see it all happen and fall into place. It means the world to me because we've been working together since August and we're a real family and working and getting this title means more than just a trophy. It's a really intense game. We know West Essex was going to come out really strong and we just had to put all of our heart and effort into it because if we didn't win, we knew our season was going to be over. So we just had to give everything in 110% all the time. It's awesome. We've worked so hard to get this. We've been knocked out in the last couple of years and so to come back and, and win it with this group is, is phenomenal. Um, they're fighters and they fought right to the end. Only a freshman. What an effort you had today. Talk about the game winner. Um, yeah, I was... We went into double overtime, and I was I was tired of having to go back and forth, so I told myself finally, you know what, this is it. I don't want our season to end. I want us to continue on, and we're going to put the ball in the cage right here, right now, and it just kind of happened.